It's very interesting where things are going here. A lot of people have many different reasons, but let's just look at the numbers first. The YouTube Rewind of 2018 has 7.6 million dislikes as I speak right now out of the 100 million views and they have only 2 million likes so then we go over to Justin Bieber's baby featuring Ludacris and it has 9.7 million dislikes 10 million likes but we're talking about out of 2 billion views and yeah I understand that totally cringe all over that but then we go to that dang YouTube Rewind and it's like a cringe to another whole level. Maybe because it's longer. Maybe because it's what they're trying to do. Yeah, it's, it's all of that. And people are saying, well, maybe it's because they don't have all the people that people like in there. They didn't have PewDiePie in there. They didn't have other people's favorite creators. Now, Let's get this straight. The, the yodeling kid, that guy is classic. Baby Shark, okay, we'll, we'll let that slide because that, that was a big thing. But everything else is like cringe, either trying to do too much or trying to be too politically correct. I think that's, that's really what it was. And just cringe in general, like the Drake song, remember that? The, the key key song that that was a big song it was fun it was a little fun time but then when they did it that sucked I'm putting my finger on the pulse of the people we don't like that politically correct crap and that's what they was doing YouTube in general is, is not politically correct like that people go on YouTube to get away from the TV some people mainly watch only YouTube. They talk about YouTube TV and they want to bring the TV to YouTube and, and now you can watch your favorite shows on YouTube. But Doug, if we want to watch those shows, we can watch it on TV. That's why you got the Trevor Noahs and these John Olivers and ugh, politics. Think about it. Most people don't like politics. You hear about it a lot, but eh, stuff is boring. We watch YouTube because it's YouTube. And I'm talking as somebody who's been watching YouTube for a long time. Let's see here, since 07, 08. We like it because it's unique. And we can watch pretty much what we want to watch when we want to watch it. And this jump right here, I never want to watch this crap again. If this was 2018, doggone it, forget 2018. And 2018 sucked according to this video. We just want to showcase how we're, we're all about mental health. That's what they want to tell you. Oh, uh, yeah, 2018, we just talked about mental health the whole time and just women empowerment. That was the whole thing, just 2018. Ugh, cringy. And you wonder why it's probably going to end up being the most disliked video on YouTube. Red, silver, J. Ooh. All I got to say.